All right, here we go. Okay, day three, it's uh, 7.22. We leave at 7.30. I've got my marshal with me, uh, Colby, and um, we're getting ready to go out there and, and see if we can move up in the standings. But we're in 43rd right now out of 50, hoping to move up in, I'd love to make that top 10. Uh, nothing that a couple of big Okeechobee bass could not take care of. So hopefully I'll get those bites and when I do get them in the boat and uh, it'd be a great day uh, out there on the water. So I'm checking in at 3.30 and uh, here we go. Hey everyone, James Dingemeyer here. Thank you for tuning back into my YouTube channel. This is competition day three from the MLF Big Five Pro Circuit down on Lake Okeechobee, stop number one. For some reason, I'm having issues with the audio from this particular clip, and I'm gonna go ahead and try to narrate some of that, kind of bridge some of the missing audio for you guys. Not quite sure what's going on, technical difficulties. Thanks for watching, here we go. Mid-morning, the wind started to whip up and it made presentations in those reeds a little more difficult as I was trying to place my bait at the base of those reed clumps. With a limit in the live well, I decided to make another move to an area that I really hadn't hit during the tournament. It was a place where I got some bites in practice, hoping to get some big ones. With only a couple hours left until weigh-in, I moved back to my primary area in hopes of catching a better quality fish and boosting my weight up and trying to make a move in the top 10. Made the right calls, made the right decisions, and unfortunately, a total heartbreaker. You get the bite you need and it comes off. Sometimes you do everything right in fishing and it just doesn't work out. It's just part of the game we play. And that's what happened with this fish. It was undoubtedly the biggest bite of the day. Oh boy, what a 